Hey y'all, welcome. I have something to tell you. I'm pregnant. Yes, it is true. Some of y'all have been wondering, and if you follow me on Instagram, then you already know. But we are expecting baby number two. So the purpose of this video is to share with y'all the big fat news, but also I got reactions from Andrew and my parents in on film. Okay, so first let me share with you how I told Andrew. So if y'all have been following me for at least a month, you hopefully will have seen the Q&A that I did with Andrew. And I'm not gonna lie, it was a bad Q&A. <laughs> there were, weren't many questions and it just it was kind of lame. Um, but that's because the whole purpose of me doing that Q&A was not necessarily to do the Q&A, but it was to tell Andrew that we were pregnant. So I couldn't just whip out a camera. I don't know, I w it would have spilled beans for him and he would have known like right away if I just pulled out a camera. So I had to be sneaky about it and I told him, you know, let's do a Q&A. So I sat him down, we did the entire Q&A, and then this happened. That is all of the questions um, that we have for you today. So, actually I have one more for you. Okay. You ready? Mm -hmm. How do you feel knowing that you're having another baby? Really? <laughs> Are you sure? Mm -hmm. Really? Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Man. What great two Emersons. <laughs> oh, <no. laughs> yep. Well, where's the proof? I'll go get it. Oh, goodness. <laughs> really? I mean, I can't make that up. Yeah. Oh. So, I found out three days ago. <laughs> No, two days ago. No. Not yesterday, but the day before. But I was not sure at all. Because the tests were very, very faint. And um, I, I, they were the blue dye tests, so you can't really... Like, they have bad evaporation lines and things like that, so I, I just wasn't sure. And then yesterday, when I went to the doctor for my checkup, um, I told her that maybe I was pregnant. Mm -hmm. And so they did a test there, and it came back negative. But then I did all kinds of research, and there, the doctor's tests are not very sensitive at all. So then I went straight, when I went to Walmart, <laughs> I uh, went straight chips. to get, yeah, I said I was getting chips from Walmart, but I went straight to get the first response six days early test. And so this is the one I took today. Yesterday's wasn't quite this dark, but I've taken four, three different types like three different brands and they're all positive so that it's like super early to tell but mm -hmm. well, why did you test I just was curious and then when they kept coming positive I was like I gotta make sure this is right you gotta pee again let me go get you some more tests <laughs> okay. I have another one and another one so I will show you them all you didn't know at all uh, not really Really? Well, I was curious, like... Well, and I was afraid yesterday you were going to notice when I ordered a decaf coffee. Hmm. Interesting. You didn't even... Like, well, because I heard you say decaf, and I thought, why decaf? But then... I thought you would have for sure known. I don't know. And then I also left a little bit of the packaging on the countertop last night. It was a little pink, like... Pink. Yeah, I saw that. But yeah. I didn't think, like, a pregnancy <laughs> test. Or the other well, ones. I'm good then. His reaction was so sweet. I actually did not anticipate him crying and just being that emotional about it. Um, but I just, ugh, I was so happy that I got that moment on camera. So that was me telling Andrew. And then I, a few weeks later, um, after I got it confirmed with the doctor, I drove to my parents' house six hours. Again, if you follow me on Instagram, you'll know that I took that road trip by myself and I surprised my mom and my grandma 
with the visit initially. So they were shocked to see Emmy and I just like walk into their house. I think two days later, I finally gained the courage to tell them, and this is how I told them. Hey guys, come look at Emerson's shirt. Oh, she's gonna turn around. Okay, show everybody. Big sister! I knew they would be excited like I didn't have any doubt in the back of my mind that they weren't gonna be excited of course they are for another grandbaby then after that I came back home and we ended up going to lunch with Andrew's parents and telling them and I was planning on filming it but the moment was just very intimate and I didn't feel like it was appropriate to pull out the camera so I didn't film that one and I'm like bummed I wish that I just kind of sucked it up and filmed it um, but at the same time it just it didn't feel right so that is how we told everybody and I'm really glad that we finally have gotten that off our chest and everybody knows now and we're not keeping any more secrets. I want to do weekly bump dates on YouTube. So I'm not going to go into too much detail about like what my symptoms are right now because um, I want to do that in a separate video, but I will tell you I'm not feeling great and today I got a phone call with my blood work results back and everything looked good except my thyroid which at the time I found out I was pregnant they also told me that my thyroid levels were low that they were just slightly off so they put me on a thyroid medicine um, and I was to be taking that and then they'd redo the blood work well they did the blood work and it came back even lower so they're gonna bump up my thyroid <laughs> because I'm so excited to be pregnant I'm so excited that Emmy's gonna have a little brother or sister we don't care what it is I mean It'd be fun to have one of each, but like if Emmy got to have a sister, that would also be really special. So like we don't care what it is. We just want a healthy baby. I know that's super cliche to say, but like that's the truth. I hope that you guys thought that this was fun. I know I am just over the moon. I can't believe it. And I'm so excited that I'm documenting this pregnancy on YouTube. So thank you guys for watching. I love you so much. Follow me on Instagram. I'm going to be probably talking every day about my pregnancy cravings or how I'm feeling that day um, and just life in general that's what I share that's when I share where I share and you can follow us on a day-to-day -day basis I love you guys so much and I will see you in the next video bye